What's up, YouTube? How y'all doing today? It is Miss Free to You. Uh uh, my daughter, <laughs> sit down. <laughs> Sorry, y'all. What's up, y'all? How y'all doing today? Um, I'm coming to you guys with, um, I know March is not over yet. Child is unit, it's just, I'm loving it. I know March is not over yet, but I'm bringing you guys some of my March favorites. Something a little different for my channel. And it is an array of beauty, fashion, and a household item. So let's jump right into it. So, first things first, y'all. This damn unit. Oh my God, I got this unit last year from my local beauty supply store. And I never, um, no, I put it on once, but I never did a wig review for it. So I was like, I'm going to do one right now. So, oh my God, first of all, purple and lavender is like anything in a purple family is like my favorite color. So I'm so loving this wig, y'all. I mean, it's just giving me all sorts of life. Like, mmm, 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 mmm. It just make you go, damn, free. <laughs> This is what it comes packed. It was from my local beauty supply store, y'all. So this is what it comes packaged in. You may be able to find it online if you can. Cool. Um, it came in like a teal color. It came in this color, and it came in like a like a yellow color, not platinum blonde, but an actual yellow. And I was like, I can't do the yellow. To me, you can. I feel like you can get away with this. Like the bottoms, it goes from lilac to pink, and then a platinum blonde at the end. I'm like, cute. And this is what it looks like. My son looking at me like, Mom, you don't go have a seat. <laughs> Mr. Day, the one that had the birthday the other day. Um, this is what the packaging looks like. And it's called Monica. And that's the color and everything. So, and that's who it's made by. So, if y'all can find it, hey, that's what's up. But, I'm, yo, this wig is everything. It sheds a little bit. I'm going to keep it 100, which y'all do. But it's so damn cute. I don't even fuck. Just pull this shit out and keep put a little hair hanging out and keep it going. I love it. These earrings that I had on the other day, um, they're not, um, these are like my favorite go-to earrings. Even though I like a lot of gold stuff, but I like this in silver too. And these are not Steve Madden. My bad, y'all. They were guests. My absolute favorites. Like, it just, these are so damn cute. Hey, got my dog, Augie. He like, what you doing, ma? Hey, Augie. Hi, booty. Hi. Sorry, y'all. <laughs> All right, so let's jump into the beauty items. So... I want to start to say this is my favorite. It's my first time using it. It's all right. Um, with the wet, with the gel liners. Not the gel. Yeah, is this gel liner? Uh, liquid liner. With the liquid liner, I feel like you got to have a steady hand for that. Oh, see, they got a little hair right there on my chest. It's all right, y'all. Just pull the damn hair if you can get it and keep it moving. I don't give a fuck about no hair. It's still cute. <laughs> Just pull the liquid, pull the, um, the liquid liner. I feel like you got to have a steady hand for it. I don't always have a steady hand because I'm not really used to putting I like I'm used to putting a pencil on. So it's different. Like I put it on, and y'all see I got some um eyelashes on y'all too. Like, mm, look at free. <laughs> Cause I don't really like I tell y'all before, I do the makeup sometime. Most of the time, if I do it, it's cause I'm going out or I do it for a video because I think it's always good to look your best on these videos. But at the same time, like I don't have to do it. Like I'm I'm in touch with my natural beauty. And if you aren't touching natural beauty, that's what's up. You know what I'm saying? If you love makeup, that's what's up. Do what you do. Do you. But for me personally, I I, I don't have to wear no makeup. Whether I wear it or not, I'm cool. So it's whatever. So I typically don't wear it for that reason. I'm just telling y'all. So it's all right. Um, this is made by Wet n Wild. And my brows, I'm finally learning how to get my brows together. I don't know if y'all can tell. Um, my brows, I got this last night from CVS made by this company and it comes with um hold up sorry for the rustling of the bag y'all but shit i gotta get the stuff out of the bag so bear with me <laughs> um it comes with this little spooey thingamajig with the brush on the end i thought that was pretty dope it comes with this palette with all of your brush colors for your hot i mean brow colors for your highlight and everything else and it came with one other thing what the hell with the other thing? Hold up. I know. Oh, it came with an extra brush, I think. My bad, y'all. I left that in the bathroom. But it came with an extra brush. Oh, no, 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 no. No, not a brush. It came with this. My bad. Um, It says brow grooming pencil. And that's what it looks like. I don't know if y'all can see it, if the camera focusing. But that's what it came with. Um, I think with a little, right? I thought that was cool. So that's one. And then... This is my very, very, very 
first time putting on myself lashes. Like I used to back in the day, I used to get the individual lashes and um I was allergic to the glue. <laughs> so I only did it for like I did it twice. I did it for a photo shoot that I did like two years ago and I had did it for um and I had did it for just to do or whatever for like a month. So the eyelashes wasn't really my thing honestly. And a friend of mine is lady that she like I like I have a lot of older friends. I mean when I say older I'm telling people that's older to be my mother. And um, I always, like, grasp to people that are older than me because I feel like they're full of wisdom and you can always learn something from them. So, my friend, she said, well, back in the day, girl, in the 70s, I used to do the lashes a little, you know, like these. You just put them on and go. And I was like, ah, let me try the individuals. She was right. These are way better. The glue ain't really bothering me. I, the only thing that's, it's not bothering me, but it's like I feel it on my eyes, so it's kind of foreign. You know what I'm saying? But they all right. They straight. I had a hard time putting these bitches on. Let me tell you that. Because I'm not used to putting eyelashes on. So, it was like, I'm going to get this shit on my eyes. So, it's probably fucked up over here. <laughs> Excuse my expression. I probably got like a piece of it on top of my leg. You can't tell unless you're all up in my grill. But, I get by. <laughs> I get by on the makeup. I'm going to get by on these. You know, I don't know what I'm doing, but I get by, child. And remember, I mentioned this the other day. This is on my lips. This is how it's supposed to look. That ombre look. And you see how it really compliments the wig and the colors in the wig. I'm like, yeah, free. Get them, girl. <laughs> so, that's what that looks like. And I showed y'all the other day. Here's the end with the lip liner end. And then here's the um, lip color end. And you just put it around the edge, the lip liner around the edge of your lips. And then fill in the space that don't have lip liner. Go like that. And boom. You got ombre. And a cute-ass ombre, might I add. So, I picked this up, Maybelline, I think from CVS. It's a contour kit. Again, I'm really new to this, new enough to this makeup stuff where I don't always, you know, I don't really know what to get. You know, some of these makeup divas, they do their thing, and I give them the absolute prop show. I mean, they put contour, they, they go hard. So, I'm still learning. I'm still trying to get used to, first of all, it's a lot of stuff you got to gather to get the makeup looks. And some of them, they'll, um, they put in the description box. Some of them will go like that real quick, and it'd be so fast, you don't really see what they're using. So, like I said, I'm still learning. But I do watch them, and I do, I'm like, look, y'all the bomb. I'm telling you, when you could do your own makeup, you could make some good money doing that, too. So, if y'all ain't out here making some money, y'all better get y'all damn, get with the program and get some money out here. Y'all could do people wetting makeup for weddings. Y'all could do people makeup when they go prom season coming. You better get some goddamn money and act like you know. But... Here go the contour kit, um, and it comes with the contour, the blush, and the highlight. So, I got all that on my face, child, and it ain't really in no specific order. <laughs> so, I'm still learning, but yeah, this, this is all right. Um, I got this eyeshadow primer on my eyes, made by Wet n Wild. It's all right. Like, the whole point in the, um, that I thought for the eyeshadow primer is for it to go on your eyes smooth. <sighs> I think I may have to spend a little bit more money for it because for the eyeshadow primer because I think this was like, I know it was under like three bucks or under three bucks if I'm not mistaken from CVS. It's all right. I might spend a little more money because I, when I do put makeup on, I want my shit to look right. Um, and I learned from my homegirl, shout out to Bipolar Max. Hey, auntie. <laughs> she said um, if you get like a cheaper eyeshadow or, or if it's not pigmented, it could be expensive, but... You wet it and it'll come out better. So that's what I did. It wasn't, it was coming out kind of weird on my eye and like it or whatever. So um, I wet the brush and it came on a little better to me. And it still complements the lilac on my hair or lavender. So that's okay. Speaking of eyeshadow, this is the eyeshadow palette that I use. I mentioned this to y'all before. It's okay. It's all right. Um, Like I said, you just, I just had to wet it. And I think that that was um, contributed to the primer. Cause I think it's a pretty decent palette. It's just the, because of the, the prom that I use. Maybe I didn't put the prom. I didn't rub it in enough. I don't know. But practice makes perfect. So we'll see. And if it don't work, I'll let y'all know. Um, for my skin, I use. I showed y'all this before. The Elf Hydrating Face Primer. My skin is oily. Oh, it's my puppy. <laughs> my skin is oily, honestly. But um, in the summertime, and we're all. I live in Florida. All this sun to just be baking the hell out of you. I think it's really good to use hydrating products, you know, to keep you from, to protect you from the sun, basically. And make sure you use a moisturizer with SPF in it. 
and I use Aveeno. I should have brought that. Um, but my favorite moisturizer right now is Aveeno Positively Radiant. So, Dede, go get the moisturizer out my bathroom. Sorry, y'all. Aveeno Positively Radiant. It's on the sink. My bad, y'all. I figured let me just tell him to go get it before he went off and do something else. And then I got this from Ross. It was $7.99. And it's a palette. It's a concealed palette. And it has every shade. It got a little card under here that show you how everything look. But inside, I ripped out the paper with all the colors and stuff. But because I, you know, you had to rip it out to use it. But here's what it looks like. It has um, two um, applications or four application sponges, two brushes, and then here's all of your contours. And it tells you like what the coverages are for. I threw the thing away in my bag. I just opened it like a few minutes ago though to use it. But it's all right. All right, you know, so when y'all go to Ross, make sure y'all look in the um, beauty aisle because sometimes they have some really good stuff. They have shampoos, moisturizers, and all of that. And by the way, everything here bought my own money. Ain't nobody paying me to do nothing. So that's for that. Now let's get into the fashion. So the other day, y'all see me going to Target and get this beautiful dress. So I'm going to do an outfit of the day for you guys in a sec. But what I didn't show you, mm, sorry, <laughs> was these bad boys. And y'all might say, oh, that ain't my style, that ain't my style. And that's fine. But these are cute. I like something. Like sometimes I, you know, I show my, well, and sometimes I do show my toes a lot. Actually, I show my toes a lot down here because it's Florida. I mean, you can wear sandals just about nine months, ten months out the year. But sometimes I don't want to. You know, you keeping it 100 like I might need a pedicure or something. So this is perfect. So I got these from Target. And the lady at the register, she was the older lady. She was like, oh, my God, girl, I cannot believe these are back out. She said, I had them in the 70s. I said, for real? So my mother probably did, too. But they hot. They so cute. They were $30 at Target. <clears throat> and here's what the box looks like. Thanks, Mr. Day. And here's the moisturizer. Positively radiant. Okay? And it has SPF 15 in it. So you can't beat that. All right, let me hurry up, y'all. I'm 12 minutes in. <laughs> Let me get y'all the shoe. I got my feet fat, so I wear like a nine and a half. Nine, sometimes nine, most of the time nine and a half. But I have to go to ten normally because if it ain't gonna run in a while, I gotta, I need, you know, I need space. So, but this is who they made by, and they was thirty. Actually, they were thirty four ninety nine. I think. Let me see. Let me make sure. I got the damn receipt. Uh, yeah, thirty four ninety nine for the shoes. And look at this cute little. I love me some Bessie Johnson. It's Bessie Johnson bag. It's everything, y'all. It's so freaking cute. And um, I still got tissue paper in it because I haven't used it yet. I had just bought it and just put it to the side. But, and I heard, I seen on um, What's the Name the other day, they said to save these. Don't throw them away because they can be used for a lot of different things. So research them. Um, silica gel. Look it up. And they can be used for a lot of different things. So don't throw these away. Save them. But they keep your shoes fresh. And I know they're good at um, keeping down mold. And they're good at, you know, keeping out moisture. So keep these things and y'all get them. But look at the inside of the bag, y'all. Ain't that cute? And it got little stripes. And it's real cute. Something you could just throw over you and go. Like, I love it. It's so freaking cute. I'm like, Betsy, like, do you know me, girl? Because you just... When she first came out, I was like, oh, this old lady, shut out. <laughs> But I like her. She, like, over the years, she started coming out with all this really, really cute stuff. And I like Betsy. That's my girl. So, without further ado, y'all, I'm going to bring you guys the outfit of the day. Make sure you stay tuned. If you have not subscribed yet, I'm going to ask you again, what is your damn problem? It's like, no. <laughs> you won't have to, but I don't see why not. I mean, it's free and costing you no money. And if you like my videos and you like my, my you know, how, not my comedy, but how I be myself, come roll with free. Like, hey. And um, I'm catching up on people's videos, trying to, to, to watch them and stuff like that. So, again, like I tell y'all all the time, bear with me. I will get back to y'all. Um, What else I wanted to say in this video? Oh, I am almost at 500 subscribers. So, I honestly haven't put together yet what I'm going to do. I do want to um, put something really nice for you guys. You know, put something together really nice for you guys and do my giveaway. So, stay tuned for that. The closer I get is when I'm going to reveal what the giveaway going to be and how you can get the gift or how you can get the prize or whatever, okay? And last thing, last but not least. So, um, this is something to... Oh, I'm so sorry I forgot one more thing, y'all. My bad. This is the household item. This is the bomb. And I'm going to be real with y'all. I don't drink coffee all the time. I had got this from Kmart um, about two weeks ago. 
And how I got it was, it was $80 and they brought it down to $64. But I had like $45 in surprise points. So the damn thing was free. I ain't pay nothing for it. Um, but like a couple of dollars for it. And um, I got some other stuff. So by the time I walked out of Kmart, I spent, what, $40 for that and the other stuff I bought. So, But it's cool because it, you can use it for tea. You can use it for hot chocolate. And you can use it for coffee. I, like I said, I don't drink coffee all the time. I'm not a huge coffee drinker. But that thing is the bomb. And it has different cup settings. It has 8 ounces and 10 ounces. If you need a bigger cup of coffee, then, um, I don't know. I guess you just get you another cup and put it up under there. <laughs> The other one, um, the other Keurig system, the regular one, the 2.0, they had that too. And they had that one for $84 and I should have got it when I saw it. But then it, by the time I went back to get me a Keurig, it went up so I got this one. So this one was the more price effective one. Because the regular Keurigs weren't anywhere from, we talking 100 and up. And I was like, mm -mm, I don't like coffee that much. So why would I spend, you know? But it's dope. I love it. It's a new favorite of mine. I just opened it and used it today and I absolutely love it. And here's the other thing I want to say to y'all. So, a lot of these guys out here, so, alright, y'all know I'm single, y'all know I'm a single mother, I'm still trying to date, I'm still trying to meet guys, not really meeting no guys, so I go on POF or whatever, from time to time, and I talk to those guys on there, most of the time I get frustrated with it and just log out the shit and don't log back on for two, three weeks, a month or whatever, but sometimes I, I find somebody who is good at engaging in conversation, it's very rare, because what's very scary now is a lot of these guys can't hold conversation, Damn, you can't hold a simple conversation? Then I don't need nothing to do with you because I love to talk. I love a beautiful mind. I like to feed off of the guy's energy. I like to get in your head. I want to know what you're thinking. I want to know. You know what I'm saying? To me, a smart, intelligent dude or intelligent dude, period, is attractive. That's a bigger turn on to me than what he got on or whatever. The other thing that drives me wild is a guy that smells good. If he got some bomb ass cologne, he's smart as hell and he's sexy. <laughs> We in there. But haven't come across that complete combination yet, ironically. So, um, but a guy turned me off the other day. Um, I had a pitch up there, whatever, and I, it's a dude on, um, on, um, um, here that said, oh, you know, you should have no side shots and this is down the third. But I thought it was a nice picture, so I put it up. Oh, if, we, if a guy see that, it automatically think you will hold, da 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 and I'm like, get the fuck out of here. You can see women go up there. I've seen, like, I know somebody else that I met on there, whatever, and we just became cool or whatever. And he showed me some of the chicks that be on there. I seen chicks on there in their drawers. I seen chicks on there, I mean, straight naked, okay? So you telling me just because I'm standing up here and I'm doing a little side pose or whatever I'm doing, I'm a hoe, like, bitch? Whatever. And excuse my expression, I just, people kill me. So... People, my thing is, the point I'm trying to make, not everybody is a damn hoe. I ain't never in my life, believe what you want to believe, never in my life been a hoe a day in my life. Don't need to be no damn hoe. My mother taught me and made sure that I embody respect for myself, okay? I may cuss and I might joke around and bug out, but I carry myself as a woman because one, I got two little girls watching me and I got two little boys watching me. And at the end of the day, they need to know what a woman should always embody. Okay. A woman should be a hard work woman. She should carry herself as a lady. She should be respected as a lady. Okay. And I just, and it's guys that will call you like another dude. I came across every other word out his mouth was ho. Bitch, da 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 da. I'm like, really? But homeboy, you got a mama. Homeboy, you probably got a sister. You got an auntie. You got female cousins. And the minute somebody call them out their name, you ready to jump on them, okay? But every other word out your oh, uh, a hoe hurt me, so I'm gonna call every woman a hoe. Are you serious? Some nigga, some dude hurt me, but at the end of the day, or more than one dude, but am I gonna call every guy? A piece of crap or call him out his name. No, because I know that God got the right man out there for me. You know, I may have to go through a couple of knuckleheads before I get to him. But I know that it's a special dude out there right now that God is grooming just for me. And I'm going to wait on him. Because he coming. And he coming soon. But he going to come when I ain't looking for him. And I'm cool with that. I like surprises like that. I like blessings like that. So I'm cool with that. But I'm just saying dudes, the dudes is watching this. Don't call women hoes and all of that every every word out your mouth. Like, are you serious? And some of these dudes in their 30s and 40s, like, come on, bruh. Like, come on. You know? I just don't understand it. Like, and I just wanted to say that. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm 19 minutes in. I just had to say that. 
But anyway, y'all, here is the um, outfit of the day. I'm going to bring that to y'all next. And uh, y'all stay tuned. Again, if you haven't subscribed already, go ahead and subscribe. Y'all ain't going to hurt you nothing. You waste your time clicking on it to look at it. Which, why you can't subscribe? <laughs> but it's all good. I can't force you. I ain't going to beg you either. But I'm just saying, obviously, I, I need. I want my subscribers. I need my subscribers. And I appreciate them. Because that way, I ain't going to hunt nobody down to tell you to look at it. You already get the notification letting you know to go look. So anyway, guys, if you love this video, don't forget to rate or like, comment, share. Most importantly, share, 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 and subscribe. All right, guys, I'll talk to y'all later. Have a blessed one. Stay tuned for the outfit of the day. Bye, free birds. See y'all later.